We're back with a story that is all new tonight. Some really scary moments for a family in Rockville. They were jolted out of bed by gunfire. Eight bullets flying right into their home, one of them striking the very mattress that they were asleep on. This happened on Longwood Drive Sunday morning, and our Leslie Moreno spoke to the family and to police as investigators try to figure out who pulled the trigger. JJ Bear and his family have lived in this Rockville neighborhood for over 40 years. People were shocked that something like this would happen. Sunday morning at around 2 a.m., his family home was hit with eight stray bullets. Right now, at least I can count one, two, three, four, five, six um, that actually hit the house. His father, who has Alzheimer's, was sleeping, and his mother, who has cancer, was right beside him. But this is alarmingly close. I mean, it's. If it was a horizontal shot, it would have taken him out. Two of the bullets pierced through the front of the home into his parents' bedroom, nearly striking them both. One here at the under the bed, um, just under, and it's in. I think the bullet might still be in the mattress. Um, they weren't able to get it because it was so far deep. And then this one is the one that uh, <laughs> doesn't let me sleep at night because it's so incredibly close to my father's head. <laughs> Another bullet was stopped by a blazer and a shoe. It was heading straight to his sister's room. It shot through her blazer. I was told it went through here and reached into her boot and um, stopped the bullet from entering the next room, which is where my sister sleeps. Vera says they heard a car speed off seconds after the shots were fired. Rockville police say it's still unclear who fired the shots or who they were intended for. Thankfully, no one was injured. They're both pretty fragile, quiet, they don't go out. So um, when trying to find a motive, that's kind of what we're really struggling with. The Rockville Police Department says it's still investigating, talking to neighbors and looking for any surveillance footage. If you have any information, contact police right away. In Montgomery County, Les Moreno, WUSA 9.